All right, what's going on YouTube? This is AJ, and I just wanted to make a quick video to talk about the best brokerage accounts for beginners. So if you've never invested or you know you don't know too much about how to purchase stocks and you wanna get into it, I'm gonna outline the best investment accounts that you can get, the best brokerage accounts available in 2019. But before I go into that, if you're not a current subscriber, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Go ahead and hit that like button because you're gonna like this video and also hit that notification bell so you'll be notified the next time I create a video. Now for me, I categorize the best brokerage accounts into three separate categories. So the first category are brokerage accounts that allow free trading. The second group are brokerage accounts that allow you to buy fractional shares. The third category of brokerage accounts are just the overall best brokerage account. They provide different resources for you to research and help you learn about investing and retirement and things of that nature. So I'll start off first with the free trading platforms. Now the first platform I'll mention, it's a very popular platform and all of their trades are not free. But as a beginner, one of the things that I recommend for people to do is to invest in index funds and ETFs. And so within this brokerage account, you actually can purchase index funds and ETFs for no trading fee. And that would be TD Ameritrade. With TD Ameritrade, they have over a hundred commission free ETFs that you can purchase. So if you wanted to buy into either the total stock market or maybe an S&P 500 uh, ETF, you do have that ability with certain funds where you can purchase it and there's no fee for the individual trade. The next platform where you can trade for free is Robinhood. Now with Robinhood, you can only purchase using their mobile app and every stock, every ETF that you purchase within their platform, there's absolutely no trading fee for those purchases. So you can go out and you can buy one share of any company that you want or one share of an ETF that has multiple businesses within it and there are no trading fees at all. The next platform for free trading is called M1 Finance. Now, similar to Robinhood, you can purchase using the app and within this platform, you can buy shares and there is no fee for trading. So you can buy as little as one share if you want. And just like Robinhood with N1 Finance, you can purchase any stock and there's no trading fee at all. With TD Ameritrade, as I mentioned, there are only certain ETFs that you can purchase and there's no trading fee. But with Robinhood and M1 Finance, anything that's available within their platform, you can purchase it and there's absolutely no fee. Now, the next category are those platforms where you can purchase fractional, also known as partial shares. So if you wanted to buy a, an individual stock or an ETF, you don't have to put the full dollar amount into that stock. So for instance, I'll use Amazon as an example because it's a very high priced stock. I believe right now it's around $1,700 for one share. So instead of on TD Ameritrade or on uh, Robinhood, if you wanted to purchase Amazon stock, you would need $1,700 in order to purchase that stock. But with these next platforms I'm gonna talk about, you can put in as little as 10, 20, or maybe even $50, and you can purchase a portion of that individual stock bond or ETF. So there are three that I'm gonna mention. Uh, the first one is Motif Investing. With this platform, you can purchase via their mobile app or also on their website. There is a fee for trading with this company. It's $9.99. You can either purchase an individual stock or you can purchase a basket of stocks, which is what they call a Motif. So with a Motif, you can purchase up to 30 stocks all at the same time. And these can be indexes as well, uh, ETFs or bonds. And you can put them all into this one Motif that you create, or you can buy Motifs that were already created by their company or other users of the platform. And there's only that one fee for purchasing the Motif. The next brokerage platform, which I mentioned in the previous uh, category, is M1 Finance. With M1 Finance, in addition to having free trading, you can also purchase partial or fractional shares. And so if you wanted to buy a piece of Amazon, not only are you getting the free trade, you can also just put 10, 20 or $50 into your account and purchase part of Amazon or any other company that you want. I just use Amazon as an example because it's one of those really high price stocks. 
Now the next platform for fractional shares is not a company I've actually used personally. All of the other companies that I'm gonna mention in this video are actual platforms that I use and that's called Stockpile. Now, what interested me in, uh, when I was researching and I found out about Stockpile is that you can purchase like gift cards that you can give to friends and family for Christmas or as birthday gifts and things like that. So I thought that was a really cool thing, which is why it included Stockpile, although it's not a platform that I actually use. And for individual trades on their platform, there's a 99 cent charge. So it's a really low fee compared to Motif or TD Ameritrade, unless you're purchasing a specific fund. So that's definitely one that I would recommend people to check out in addition to the other ones that I've mentioned so far. Now, the next category is the best trading platform overall. So with most brokerage firms, you have the opportunity to buy stocks and you can buy, you can trade options you can trade forex there are so many different things that you can do with brokerage account and so i just want to focus on what i believe are the top two and i'll go over the reasons for that now the top two overall best platforms to me regardless of cost this is mostly about the features available within that platform the first would be td ameritrade now td ameritrade is actually the first platform i ever used when i got into investing and wanting to learn about trading. So with TD Ameritrade, they did have this thing called paper trading. You could create a paper trading account where you didn't have to actually put money in, but you can practice using their platform. You can practice purchasing stocks and you can use their platform to access all of the research that they have to actually teach you how to invest and teach you how to plan for retirement and lots of different resources like that. Another company that has very similar access minus the paper trading accounts would be E-Trade. Now E-Trade was the second platform that I joined. And the reason I joined E-Trade was because of the Facebook IPO. Just like TD Ameritrade, they do have a lot of resources that you can use to research stocks or to learn about how to trade and how to invest for your future. So these are the top brokerage accounts for beginner investors. And with the three categories, we talked about free trading, we talked about buying fractional shares, and we talked about just an overall good platform if you wanna do your own research and if you wanna do some more advanced trading in your future. Now, my favorite investment account, and also what I think is the best investment account for those within the financial independence retire early community, also known as FIRE, I will mention that in my next video. So with this account, you have free trading, you have fractional shares, and you have a little bit of research, not as much as TD Ameritrade or E-Trade, but you can get into those really low expense ratio Vanguard funds, which many of the people in the FIRE community talk about. So I talk about that platform more in my next video, so stay tuned. All right, guys and girls, thanks for watching. I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day to watch this video. If you're not a current subscriber, go ahead and click that subscribe button now. Go ahead and hit that like button because you really like this video and also hit that notification bell so you'll be notified the next time I create a video. Again, I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day to watch this. Uh, have a great day. Thanks.